welcome back everybody i just wanted to give a quick update as to what i've been up to the past few weekends last weekend i decided it was about time i go and visited my sister uh a little further ways out away from me and we decided to have a lovely day trip through the wine country of arizona and so what you're seeing first is us driving through Patagonia and then heading out towards Noida. Uh, there's a lot of lovely wineries out there uh, with uh, various drinks and they also have mead and fruit wines. But today we actually visited a really nice brewery out in that area and we were able to sit out on the patio and just enjoy the monsoon season as well as some of their beers that they had on tap. And of course I realized when I was driving out there that I had completely forgotten to bring my little tripod for my camera so I could film what it was like out there. And I mainly spent my time enjoying myself and my sister's company and knitting. We did knit out there. Uh, but I don't really have many photos or videos showing me doing that, so I'll, I apologize. So in this video, you get us driving through the countryside to get a taste of what it's like out here when we finally do get rain. And also, we decided to make a quick stop to Tombstone as well, historical town. Uh, there we also tried a few breweries and we also took pictures of the main street as you can see it was pretty busy even though we just finished a pandemic so it was nice to kind of get out and see the sceneries and then on our way back film some more and the knitting that i brought out for this trip was the lovely j sweater that i am working on and very soon you'll probably see this pop up. So this is a sweater I'm making for a friend in England. Uh, it's rather cold for her there since she's a native southwestern uh, person. So just being able to knit something for her that will hopefully help keep her warm as she gets used to living across the pond. It's just something I really wanted to do for her. And so far, I've really enjoyed knitting this sweater. I'm currently working on the sleeve now, the first sleeve. I, I really need to learn how to uh, do and knit two sleeves at a time. And that's something I'll eventually learn, but luckily I don't suffer too badly from uh, sleeve fatigue or second sleeve fatigue, that is, for knitters. So this is one of the fastest uh, projects I've done. I pretty much knitted up this body and the sleeve in all less than a month. Uh, usually it takes me quite a few months to finish a project, but I was able to really focus on it during my vacation with my family. And so very excited to finish this sweater and send it off and start a new sweater. I seem to always have a thing for sweaters and at some point maybe I will make a video of my sweater collection, what I'm planning to add. I already have my next project uh, chosen and I can go in into that later and I will be finishing up my quilt. Just I've been busy uh, working and doing some house sitting so that's been put on the back burner a little bit since I didn't want to lug all my sewing supplies with me. But hopefully this coming weekend I'll have some time to put the borders on and show you the finished top and then eventually uh, take some videos as I quilt it. So thank you for following me along on this journey through the countryside and checking out my current knitting project and hopefully you guys have a wonderful week. Thank you so much and we'll see you next time.